So, um, our time, we just wanted to do. Oh, oh like Michael. <laughs> <laughs> going to do? Uh, good question. The code <laughs> is going, uh, we just wanted to do a simple auton so that we could, like, have a base to work from when we're doing the actual programming. Um, so it's supposed to go forward, turn around, and come back. However, we did have to, um, change the speeds for the left and the right. They're very, very different because, um, the robot likes to heavily tilt left, so, um... <laughs> It almost worked. Alright, so we finished off every single logo that we had. So the sticker logo for the back of the car, and all the other logos for the shirts, and the avatar should all be completed now, and they're all in the drive. We also have been working on the plate that's going to have all of our sponsors, which is being done by Michael over here. He is going to have that plant, uh, Done and put on these sides of both robots. We started working on chairmen, so we're gonna have someone take uh, drone shots of the entire school, so we can add on to that. First, we tried this, it broke, it bent in half, and it started ripping, so we switched to the stronger type. Oh, stop! We basically got all the wheels on, we just need to put on the wheels to have the motors on top right here, and we, do, and we need to get the springs on. Where does it go? Can you, put it, can you put it on the frame? Okay. Okay. Cool. Thanks, guys. So what we've got is our climber. The way it works is we have a cable that will reeled in by a pulley at the bottom, and it's guided by two pulleys, and it's got linear bearings. We're working on mounting a second motor up here so that it'll pull down with a lot of force. Okay. For electrical, okay. we've finished all the wiring for it. Each sub-team, we have a PWM motor controller designated, and we have a diagram drawn up for every motor, motor controller, power. And the way that this system works is... Uh, Swings open. Yeah. The cords aren't long enough right here because we had to improvise with timing. Yeah. But yeah, it'll be able to fully go to a 90 and then back down. So you have access to get in here. They could put our school colors on a strip that's going to be mounted at the bottom of the robot or around the bottom of the box so we could see us from a distance. And this is the sequence they liked, they came up with. They've been working on lots of different sequences, tried like six different patterns, and this is the one they came up with. So they did a good job. The lights I plan on putting underneath and around the box in here so you get a nice glow effect for the robot. So this was the original cage we had to hold the pins. This could hold 82. I worked on yesterday and today to make this. This can hold 205. The percent increase is 167%. Nice. We are the development team and we have a website. We're gonna go over the entire thing because we can. So first of all, up there is the buttons that can take you to anything, any of the pages. We'll get there in a second. Um, the key feedback button, like we were talking about, is right here, front and center now. It'll take you to a nice form where you can do your team feedback. And over here, we have a paragraph about who we are. Some links to the team calendar. Sign up for the newsletter. And also, if you need to add something to the team wish list, it's all right here in the links tab. Scroll down. Next, we have all of our sponsors, and we have all their images. If you click on one, like uh, Gordo Ford here, it takes you to the Gordo Ford website. Yeah. All right, you can go back now. All right, so then scroll down. And over here, we have the sub teams. If we took a picture of you today, or some other time, it's gonna go right here eventually. Here we have a contact form, and that's about it. Woo. 
We finished all the safety posters. Now we have eight safety posters. One in Mr. Douglas's room, two in the build room, one of them for the pits, and then just kind of like four extra, so like for the stands and wherever else we want to put them. Thank you.